For my Stripe project, I created a slow growing spiral and converted it to an NFT on the blockchain. This is a genius way to keeping ownership for digital art. Hi, my name is Armand and I'm a seventh grade student at Singapore American School. In this project, I created a captivating piece of art and after my creation was finished, I used OpenSea.io to mint it into an NFT. This transaction is now forever stored on the blockchain. I was surprised to learn how easy it was to buy an NFT. All you had to do was find a reputable NFT trading platform and look for a piece. Once I find a piece that I like, I want to make an offer. As long as my parents let me buy some crypto, all I need to do is choose how much I like to buy it for and hit the make offer button. The art I uploaded to the blockchain was fully coded by me. By looking at the art, you would think that the color is dependent on the radial distance from the center. However, if you notice, when the spiral turns back on itself, the colors are different than the base spiral. This method also gives the spiral a three-dimensional feel, as if we're weaving a ball and seeing the process at a bird's eye view. I was quite shocked at how a good, simple spiral could look. By altering very small amounts of color, radius, angle, growth change, we could create vastly different visual experiences. I really enjoyed learning about completely new technologies, such as Web 3.0 and blockchain. Armand is probably one of the few seventh graders in the world that has invested the time to learn, create, and own an NFT. He understands that Web 3.0 has the potential to paint a radically different future, and he thought it was worth his time to actually invest and understand what this is all about. At the same time, he's shown to us that art can be painted with the paintbrush of code and mathematics. Look for the piece. I was surprised to learn how easy it was to create. <laughs> he must think create.